Hey guys, just want to go over the two trades, day trades we had in the room today. Um, we only traded for about an hour and a half. We didn't even, I didn't take a position till after eight as far as day trade. And then we traded both sterling New Zealand dollar and uh, sterling versus the yen. I guess we'll do pound yen first because that's what I have up. So pretty simple. You know, for those of you that missed it, maybe for those of you that are new, we talked about yesterday, I mean, Cable had a big move Sunday night. All right, I talked about this in our live uh, afternoon session also. But Cable had a big move for in the London session yesterday, right? And so there wasn't a whole lot to do unless you caught this move down. You just can't chase it lower. What we wanted was an oversold relieving rebound, and that's what we got today. So I like that when... You have a downtrend, and you're going to get price to stick its head up because you can whack it back down. But you just have to learn how to work your position size. You can be too early, and then it, it creates, you know, anxiety, fear, uh, too much pain. You'll end up stopping out right when you want to be getting more aggressive. So this is this is all about the timing aspect. This is all about how, you know, I teach you guys to work your cycle. So the 30 minute was actually. Um, it was down and then crossed up during this rally, which is okay. It was still high, relatively speaking. This would be low within the range. This is fairly high. Um, but it was giving us some pause, so you got to check the 15 minute and you have to be aware of what the 30 minute's doing. And sure enough, 15 minute crossed here about 8.30. We started our trades a little bit early, scaling in short. And of course we did that on lighter size because we're waiting for what I call the right hand side of the cycle. You got that here, you got that here. Um, these were breaks in the trend, which we see on the five minute and the one minute. Okay, first to break is obviously the one minute here, and then the five minute broke here. And that breaks your trend. And then that was the follow through. And that was pretty much it. That was enough to have a nice little trade. Didn't have to risk a lot to make 1% or so, depending on the size of your account. If you're working the size like I teach you guys, that's a pretty easy move there. And then uh, we were pretty much done for the day. You could have resold this bounce with the same process and made, you know, another, who knows, 15 to 30 pips. Um, but that was it for me, hour and a half, I was done. And then you could have done the same thing on New Zealand dollar. And um, essentially what that looked like was same process, very similar looking chart. You have the downtrend in the 30 minute. Um, today it was the oversold relieving bounce. All right, same thing, the cycle was high. You really didn't roll over till 8.30 there. That was a key sign. We were able to start selling a little bit early, like I teach my traders. All right, some some traders are always looking for confirmation. They're always waiting for this, waiting for that, and then they need to see all this bearish bearishness before they get short, and it's too late. So we like to sell into strength, but you just have to know the correct way to work your size. All right, 15 minute cycle rolled first, five minute broke. Obviously earlier, and this was a nice sharp decline. Boom, we covered the lows. And again, that was pretty much sideways the rest of the day. So guys, here's what it looked like in the active trader room. This is where I post all my alerts. So for those of you that don't know, I have a real-time alerts product. Um, it's only 150 bucks a month. It's pretty much, it is every, every trade I do, day trade, swing trade, long term. Um, and it's all based around the same institutional work that we literally charge tens of thousands of dollars for monthly. And I make this available to the individual traders. So um, this is my first signal or one of the first signals of the day, copper. I was coming out of that. And there's three grand. All right. Um, what else were we doing? We're starting to position short bonds. Uh, we came out of some of our coffee long. I was reshorting the Aussie, still long, dollar peso. Been absolutely crushing that. Uh, here's some profits here on, on coffee. We were ringing the register there today, 
eleven hundred dollars. Here's uh, the peso, thirteen hundred bucks. So you guys can do this. This isn't about me. This is about me teaching you the process that I had to bang my head on the wall for ten years and struggle and fix and figure out what's working, what's not working. I shorten that learning curve for you. So here's here's what it looks like. Guys, these are the signals on the day trade I just told you about. Pound Kiwi, selling high, covering, adding, reducing, covering into the lows. All right, same thing here. Pretty much sold the high, pound yen. Cover, you know, cover, reshort, cover. This is high level professional trading. This is what I teach you. Both of those went for over 40, 50 pips. This is what one of my traders sent. All right, on a small size account, that's what's possible. All right, guys, we do this every day. We're in here trading, so um, it's over 65 pips there on that cover. All right, guys, so look, come join us. Um, I don't care if you're new to trading or you're, you're an experienced professional. I mean, I'll teach you my model, my process. You can add it to yours. Um, or you can go down and try to figure out on your all on your own, but it's just more than likely going to cost you time and money. So if you want to join us, here's the Real Time Alerts product. Guys, this is my full access team, I call it. We trade together 24-7. Uh, I teach you the model. It's over nine hours of on-demand video. You get the Real Time Alerts product. And then again, we trade together, and that's where the real growth comes is not just hearing something and seeing a new way of trading, but it's actually getting in there and doing it every day and working on the habits, getting rid of the bad habits, and just grinding on the process every day. All right? And then I have an options session and team that I'm building. I teach you the ratio back spreads. Um, this is mostly for swing trades and long-term wealth type of plays. And I teach on the model there, and then I teach you the option strategy. If you're interested, you can click there. All right, guys, I'll talk to you in the morning. Uh, again, my site's Jenkins Risk Management. Just go to JenkinsRM.com or send us an email at support at JenkinsRM.com. All right, guys, I'll talk to you next.